another fitting video. Yeah, time to do another one. Again with the slow motion, but maybe not during the entire video. And in this video we will feed... Where are you going? The tarantulas that we didn't feed in previous feeding video. And then hopefully in next feeding video we will feed the species that we didn't feed in last video. I mean, yeah, last video and this video. That's the idea. But before we jump into that, look, I have an egg sac. Don't get too excited. It is unfertilized egg sac from Tapinau Henius violatius, female, of course, female. And this is actually her second unfertilized egg sac. I don't know why she's doing that. Look, she's moving through her enclosure now. Let me see if you can get a sneak peek of her. You see, there she is, down there, pretty pretty, and she definitely needs bigger enclosure now. And probably when she molts next time, I will try to find a mate for her, a male, so she can actually get some action and actually become a mother since she wants it so much. Oh, she's going up. Now when I'm showing, she's going down. You are not cool. Maybe we can feed her first. She's probably hungry. Okay, a roach, tweezers. Don't move. No, no, no. No, she went down again. But it looks like she's on a stroll, so I assume she will come back up. Come, beautiful. I know you're hungry. Ooh. Nice, she got it immediately. Not immediately, what am I saying? After I poke her with the roach, then she got it. Hey, hey. See you later, look. She's really skinny now because she made that egg sack. Need to get that abdomen nice and round. Next one, let's take something, something standard and something easy to record. This is a well-known Acanthoscuria geniculata and I don't know what sex it is. All I know is that she is almost always hungry. What did I say? That took some time but now she got him. In case you are new to the hobby and you want to have a tarantula that is always outside, big, nice, always eats, that's the one. Eats everything, everything without questions. Something a bit different. Mantis. Oof, I forgot the scientific name. But this is that green one. And if you remember, she was tiny when I got her. Molted like four times since then and gaining some noticeable size. Also in a desperate need for new enclosure. Here is the roach for you. <laughs> there we go. I think she grabs the tweezers also. <laughs> So apparently she will be huge, 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 huge. So I'm really excited to see how exactly huge she will become. That means that she will also need to get a huge enclosure. Not a problem, right? Let's carry on. The elephant in the room, Caribena versicolor. She was showing off this entire time. Was she? Yeah, you could see her the entire time of this video. Let's feed her. Ooh, that was that was insane reaction. I think the slow motion will be superb if everything is in focus, of course. Even though I'm not using the macro the macro lens, it is still hard to keep everything in the focus, especially because in slow motion mode you cannot have automatic automatic focus, auto focus. You need to set it up manually and then hope to tarantula stay in that that area that you set. 
If tarantula moves during feeding, it moves out of focus area and you can do anything about it. I think we almost had a happy dance. It was like turning around. Anyhow, you can now see what she actually did. Oh, are you happy dancing now? Well, actually, yes, that is a happy dance. How lovely, but I wanted to show you. You see what she did to that bromeliad. She covered it whole in web, the whole bromeliad. And she's actually hiding behind it and not in the cork bark as I intended. Mm. Tarantulas, they always have some different ideas that differ from yours. Not a fan of that. Now every time when I need to water the bromeliad, I just spray her web and she freaks out. But well, that's her own fault for, be for being there. Actually, actually, I will leave her here so we can keep an eye on her. Yeah, like that. So we can see when she's happy dancing. And we will carry on. Sambra Hepelma. Oh, don't be bolty. Oh, come on, come on, chill, chill. Chillax. This is Brahipelma classy. Yeah, classy. Really young female, as you can see. So far she was good eater, so hopefully that won't change now. Oh, that was like slow grab. She just slowly scooped the roach. Let me show you up and close. There she is. <laughs> Why you spread like that? But yeah, this is one of my... I believe I have 11 different Brahipelma species. I'm not sure, I don't know. Getting closer to every, every species available in Hobby. And I set that goal like maybe a year and a half ago. So I would say a decent progress. Happy dance. <laughs> Oh, don't go out. This is Brahipelma auratum. I'm really not sure which Brahipelma species is my favorite, but this one is really close on the on the top. I'm gonna grab it from the tweezers. Whoa, whoa, whoa what happened there? <laughs> it will be interesting to see the slow motion. <laughs> well, you already seen it, but I haven't. So here it is. You see, it is pretty similar to X Miti now Hamori, but it got less orange on its. So you can clearly see that it is different. I mean, check how small it is, and it is still awesome looking. And let me show you the third Brahipelma on the table. This will be, I think, last one in this feeding video. This is standard Brahipelma albiceps. It is also young female, just like that Auratum. Slow motion set. Roach in tweezers. We can go. Wow. Immediate catch. Always impressive to see. Nice species, but Auratum much nicer. I mean, much prettier. Now, let's see if we can do something more special. This is the Tipsy Hedelicus. I didn't remember the new name. I didn't really remember it because Psychedelicus looks so much, I mean, sounds so much cooler. Let's see if we can get a takedown. Fail, Roach escaped. Second attempt. Come on, I know you are down there. Oh, no. That was first feeding clip of this species. Awesome. Another standard tarantula, Lasiodora parahibana. This is the one with regrown leg. You see this back leg is regrown. Ready, set, go. Oh, God, oh, don't freak out. Don't be bolty. Here it is in its all glory. You see how tiny that leg is. Hilarious, but it is much better than not having a leg, right? And on next mode, it will probably be as good as new. Oh, actually, I have another Brahipelma on the table, the Brahipelma Kalembergi. This will also be one fast feeding clip. She usually just takes it down without a fuss. One, two, three. <laughs> Oh, 
Thank you for your cooperation. Bit close up. There. Sweet, sweet, sweet. Let's try and feed this dwarf species. Don't remember the species name, but it is cool. It did molt once, but it already ate two times, so it shouldn't be a problem. Come out, come out. Oh, whoa. Oh, have you seen that? It actually pulled the entire enclosure. I think we had a really nice takedown clip. Hell yeah! Oh, I just remembered. I need to ask you for a, a tiny favor. You know that I skate and all that good stuff. I have some skateboarding channel. I rarely upload there, even though I have a ton of recordings and complete footage for other videos for that channel. And I never really have time to edit those videos because with three videos per week on Dark Den, it is like one day is recording, the other day is editing. One day is recording, the other day is editing. And once I edit the Dark Den video, I don't really feel like edit some other random videos. But this time I went with friends to one awesome skate park and I made some pretty cool video that I'm kinda proud of so I will link you the channel and the video in the description or I think I can even link it here so if you're interested go ahead and check it out it is on creation but my other friend already made the subtitles so you should be able to understand what we are talking about and it is kind of funny video at least to us I don't know how it will be to the rest of you <laughs> I will remind you once again once this video is finished so you don't need to pause now and go to check that video I will remind you Next tarantula, Hilobrahi species Vietnam blue. This will be tricky to record. I don't think that I will be able to get a slow motion on this one, but I will try anyway. Woo! <laughs> that was crazy. I was looking through the display and all I see was Fangs! Some fangs popping. But I think it was good. Another Hilobrahis. This one is Huahini. Male. He webbed a lot, so I'm not sure if he is in a pre molt or not. No, but his main entrance is open, so we will try it out. Let's -a go! Nice! Will you maybe come out? You like your orange... orange legs, but no, 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 don't go in. Oh, oh! He's coming. Pretty boy. Hello. How are you doing? I really didn't expect that. Oh, we have a happy dance. Nice! Yeah, yeah, just continue. Continue on. Don't worry about me. Just do your thing. Do your dance. <laughs> so hopefully in a molt or two he will mature and then we will breed it with the female. The female is huge and that female was actually my second tarantula so it will be awesome. I appreciate that he came outside and show it off like that. I only have one tarantula left so this is practically the end of the video so really cool. First time that I'm feeding it on the video. Also the Vietnam blue, same thing. Awesome. We will let him enjoy that meal. In the final, it is Gramostola, Gramostola pulcherpes male. He wasn't really a good eater, but ever since he molted, he became like eating machine. So let's see if this final... Oh, you're going that way. No, he's going in the hole. Oh. So the final feeding clip will be this. Really? Come on. No, he went inside. Okay, never mind. Kilo Brachis Joachini clip was amazing, so I don't mind that. One quick reminder, go and check my skateboarding video. Link is in the description and maybe here. Go and check it out. Anyway, if you enjoyed this video, what? I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, thumbs it up and comment something. If you want to support this channel even more, there's a Patreon page. If you're new to this channel, make sure to subscribe. I upload every Monday, Wednesday and Friday. So see you again soon. Go check the video. Bye-bye.